our pub with rising damp. You'll be back in time for opening, won't you? Yeah, of course. If you want Cockney swagger, you call Danny Dyer. Sent in to pull pints and bring the punters back to EastEnders. But now the new executive producer's revealed even more of a makeover is coming. He's claimed that the show, which was born in 1985 when Dirty Den was running riot, is frozen in the past and, in his words, needs to move into the modern world. So the big bosses have had a brainstorm and transported themselves... Back here to the gritty streets of East London and I know what you're thinking, this looks a lot like Albert Square. That's because this was the original East London Square which inspired EastEnders. So last week, producers came here, I imagine sat on Arthur's bench and had a serious summit to talk new storylines. Like a true cliffhanger, they're not giving much away. We do know that Sharon's plans to open a trendy new wine bar could rival the Queen Vic, and you heard it here first. Last week, Shane Ritchie, aka Alfie Moon, told Channel 5 News changes were coming. It's a wonderful new family that have taken over the Queen Vic, and it's a great asset to the show, and things are moving forward. And, and you know, the show needed a shake-up, and Dominic Treadwell Collins, our new exec, has done just that. 80 pence a bag, links, come along. Of course, if you want real EastEnders, look no further than Ridley Road in London. The inspiration behind Wolford's own Bridge Street Market, Larry Julian told me he's the Phil Mitchell of this street. They're missing the humour, the humour. It's all about the social, not just the social side of it, it's all about the humour. The, the, the greatest thing about EastEnders is the funny side of it all. Uh, and they don't have that at all, in it. And Phil, sorry Larry, isn't the only one who wants Wolford to have a makeover. So what is it, stuck in the past? Yeah, yeah, them the weird behind. Oh, I just like it, because it's like East End, mate, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> so it doesn't need to move with the times, you're happy? I'm happy with it. And if you're looking for new stars, then look no further than the real East End. Minnie Stevenson, Channel 5 News.